40% of the human population live within 100 kilometers of a coastline, whilst the global shipping sector accounts for over 3% of the planet's annual GHG emissions. Coastlines and ports operate as monetary veins to the planet's economy, with 90% of goods estimated to be transported by sea each year. As a result, there is a huge demand for energy at ports and in coastal and island communities. This geographical concentration of industry and population results in higher local greenhouse gas emissions, particularly around ports. Marine and government regulatory authorities have committed to installing shore power solutions by 2025 making it mandatory for ships to run on non-fossil-fueled power generators whilst in port. The biggest issue for shipping at the moment is onshore power supply and the source of that onshore power supply. Much of the power generated in Europe is with uh, gas or coal um, and any opportunity to decarbonize uh, power for shipping is greatly welcomed. Solar Marine Energy was formed back in 2016 by a team of experienced marine professionals who have over 80 years experience designing and working on floating structures exposed to some of the harshest ocean waves. We use this experience to design and construct innovative and robust floating solar systems. By going mobile, going on a barge, um, you eliminate um, infrastructural requirements so you can very quickly deploy this technology in, in a kind of a, a distributed port scenario. Solar Marine Energy's registered IP technology solution mounts corrosion resistant PV panels on floating structures at an orientation that maximizes the capture of the diffuse light element of the light spectrum. Solar Marine Energy's groundbreaking floating structure efficiently shield wind and wave loads. Solar Marine's technology can deliver 30% more power density per square meter. The electricity produced can be stored in battery banks on floating barges, for example, making the power supply mobile. This electricity can provide clean power to ships alongside key walls or whilst they are anchored. Floating solar energy plants can also be used as hybrid energy plants to power shoreside or floating hydrogen electrolyzers, or to simply charge onshore battery banks. The shoreside electricity market is experiencing a compound annual growth rate of 6.7%, with a predicted market value of $1.5 billion by 2025. Solar Marine Energy's groundbreaking technology doesn't just guarantee the reduction in emissions through renewable energy, but it also offers multiple other opportunities to coastal industries, communities and energy supply systems.